All right, a little hive inspection. This was a hive that was doing super and I split it. It's the one from uh, another video where I had split it, but I ended up accidentally leaving too many queen cells. And then it ended up doing some swarms, some virgin swarms off. So I, you know, I've been wondering if there was a queen in here that got mated. And there is, I found her. She's just doing average. She's not lights out. I'm a little uh, surprised or disappointed, but she's a brand new queen. So uh, maybe she's just taking a while to get started, but I'm gonna pull the frame up. She's beautiful. I'm gonna pull the frame up and let you see if you can find her. I'm sure you can. Experienced beekeepers can easily find her, but I, if, if, if you're not an experienced beekeeper, then this may be a good opportunity to see what a, what a big, beautiful queen looks like. All right, I'll give you a hint. Oops, she's right in there. You see her? She's a big one. She's staying up under there. Come on up, come on up. Let's look at you. There you go. That's what you're looking for when you're looking for queens. You can tell she's a whole lot bigger. The body's a lot longer. The abdomen's longer. She don't even have stripes. So anyway, but but look at her pat. She she's doing okay. I mean, I, there's a lot of capped brood. But then also looking at this frame, there's a lot that's not even to the capping stage. So maybe she's doing better than I. I think she's doing it. May just been a slow start, but where she is? Let me zoom back. I know she's in the frame, but I can't find her to zoom in. There you are. Anyway, that's what a queen bee looks like. All right.